the wonderful case made by Parbury here uh, depicting the scene of longitude solved with Kronos coming out of the Atlantic, lifted out with help from Britannia, sat on her chariot. And then in the background you've got the, the ship crossing the Atlantic from the Americas to Europe and the cliff and the trees in the background with the Britannia sat on uh, some native Indian uh, weapons. The detail of Britannia is wonderful, isn't it? Her uh, gown, the swirls of her dress, the ornaments, the flowers on her dress. In the Atlantic, you can see South America, North America in the engraving, and then Kronos, then up to the cliffs and the woods surrounding the uh, North Atlantic. And rolling the case round again to show the wonderful set of engraving. Here, the first one here has a waywiser, a tripod with a plane table, a compass and a sighting rule for surveying. coming round to navigation with a sighting telescope, a chart roll, azimuth compass, front staff and back staff. And then round to astronomy, re represented by a ruler, a telescopic quadrant, a gunter quadrant and a protractor. And then time, represented by a clock, a sunglass, a sundial, and a watch. I think all of this was made by hand by tapping from the back into pitch the gold case to get these wonderful details and then the engraving done on top of that. got the, the name of uh, the gold chaser, Parbury. His name proudly displayed. Parbury was the foremost exponent of this art of wonderful how you could form a thin gold case into a work of art like this. Isn't it beautiful? <laughs>